Hello and welcome to stage six of Aggressive Ambition, driving for the Koenigsegg Agera RS. I've got 17 of 28 upgrades, more on that in a bit. Don't start this event without a 2.5 million R dollars and 500 gold. Uh, that should give you enough because you earn a little bit in the process. I just put my steering assist on high. And if you know my channel, you know I never race with assists. This is one of the tracks I do. Helps to smooth out the corners. Right now for upgrades, I've got the engine on three, drivetrain on three, body on three, exhaust on three, and tires and wheels on three. The other two are on one, and that ends up biting me in the rear a little bit. I got all speed-related upgrades, and so, yeah, last time I did this event, back when it very first came out, I had all threes except for engine, and in the end, that would have been cheaper if I did that again. But anyway, more on that as this event goes on. I'm gonna get to the costs later on, here, this isn't too bad. I'm not driving this as good as I should have, but so right here, I just lost my average speed, which really surprised me, but then I get it back. If you let the Venom catch up with you, he could give you a push, but he will probably take you out. Anyway, there we go. Not too, too bad. Uh, pretty fast race, actually. This one, yeah, it's interesting that the uh, time is actually hard on this one. So, like hitting the speed is easy, but doing it in that much time, some people are gonna have a lot of trouble with that. But this is an old school event, they're, they're not easy. So the expectation is that you need to get up to level five upgrades for some of these things. So just like there again, I raise your thin on time. Now here I'm gonna do some interesting strategy. <laughs> I don't know if it was completely necessary, but I'm gonna do some wall breaking which sometimes doesn't work very good. I mean, I mean that sounds crazy, wall breaking. Yes, it does sound crazy. You can use a bit of off track here, but not very much. Oh, it's a strange strange place to have an aerial atom. Oh, that's a horrible place. Incredible acceleration, but not the best grip. So he's gonna be a problem. What are you doing, man? He's going, oh, and I'm all sideways, oh boy. So this won't be a perfect run. Obviously, this, isn't, this won't be too, too difficult. Wall braking, that's when you brake late and you grind the front of the car against the wall and then pull out of it before you completely nail it. Because there is definitely a, oh, that didn't work so good. Not too bad though, actually. Um, very little off track is allowed, like just a tiny bit. You might notice this is a very short video. The, the races aren't very long and they're fast. So that's why this video doesn't go on too long. Oh, I'm all over the place loose not used to my braking points here at the road course. I really just didn't run it very much. So I've got one more lap after this to catch him. As soon as you pass him, it's over. He's hard to catch. So I wouldn't necessarily draw out the race because once he gets on the speedway, he's gone. Forget about it. He's going to disappear on me. Let's see if I can catch him here. I doubt it though. Like that was a really good entrance onto the speedway. I did really good right there. Look at him. Look at him take off. Like, wow, he's driving that thing. And that thing's got heavy upgrades. I'm catching him a little bit through here. Okay, if I drove at full speed into the wall, I might actually overtake him, but I don't really want to do that. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, I really overdid it that time. Oh, that was atrocious. Okay, so you know what? Based on how horrible I'm doing, none of that is necessary. Wall braking is not necessary. Because, I mean, I lost all sorts of speed. Proper braking would be just fine there. Woo, all over the place. I'm gonna catch him though. Uh, you can see I'm pretty close to him right now. I'll catch him at the next set of corners here because they're very technical and he's going to slow down a lot more than he needs to because he's a bot. And the major weakness of bots is cornering. But I'm all over the place, sloppy agape. Okay, and I'm ending it. Okay, there we go. Now, let's get to the nasty. I probably spent eh, one and a half hours on this trying to do it with the upgrades I had. Here's what I ended up with. All threes except for suspension, just about 2.25 million R dollars, 470 gold is my cost. Of course, then there's rewards. This is ridiculously hard. Almost no braking at that first corner, only this lap. Very slight braking here. And then I'm back to the throttle as I'm still going down into the corner. Do not get your left side tires on the uh, infield. The car is gonna start to lose it. So you're gonna notice me go just under the white line, but then not over the asphalt, okay? I'm not getting below onto that, like right, the white there, just nicking it, that's it. And then way up high. This is 
very difficult. Okay, I'm gonna repeat something I said on a different day because you might not have heard it. When you buy upgrades, the bots get slower and the targets get lower, okay? So this might not be possible with less than... No, I did it with less than six upgrades. I did it with less than six upgrades the first time the event ran. I'm gonna have a video to that at the end here. Uh, I'll, I'll have the video for this exact race back in the original series. I did it with quite a lot less upgrades, actually. And they lowered the PR now versus back when this first, first ran. But I went with all grip-related upgrades back then. Now, here I am. I gotta stay behind them for the full 10 seconds, and then I gotta get around them. And that's where this can get dicey, is getting around it. Like, I was trying to go to the outside. No, I couldn't get there. And then he's gonna drive off on me a little bit. And I am going to give him a little tap. I didn't really mean to do that. I was trying to get to the inside. I hit him in the rear quarter panel. Of course he washed out. And now I'm slowing down to let him catch up, but I don't want to do this again. So after I added the upgrades, it still took me about a half hour to figure it out, guys. That's a hard one. Please like, please subscribe. There's my upgrades. Stay tuned for stage seven. You do need my help. It is still quite difficult. Thank you so much for joining me. See you real soon.